Instead of opting for a new primary combat tank, the US Army is choosing to upgrade its existing fleet of M1A2 Abrams tanks. The M1A2 Abrams stands as one of the most exceptional main battle tanks globally. Initially adopted in 1992, it has progressively undergone modernization and several upgrades. The latest upgrade, referred to as System Enhanced Package 4 or SEPV-4, is a collaboration between the US Army and General Dynamics. The tank's full upgraded designation is M1A2 SEP V4 Abrams. A prototype was initially spotted undergoing testing in 2022 and closely resembles the previous M1A2 SEP V3 version. Noteworthy improvements include enhanced gunners and commander sights, upgraded fire control and communication systems, and compatibility with the newly developed XM1147 programmable round. This upgrade, known as the SEPV-4, significantly enhances the tank's lethality. Anticipated deployment of the upgraded tanks to operational units is expected around 2025. Rather than manufacturing new hulls for the Abrams tank, the United States has chosen to refurbish and rebuild existing hulls from stocks to meet new standards. The plan is for this fleet of upgraded M1A2 tanks to continue serving with the U.S. Army until 2050 and beyond. The tank maintains its M256 120mm smoothbore gun, capable of effective fire at distances exceeding 4 km. An added data link on the SEPV-4 facilitates communication with the programmable M1147 Advanced Multipurpose Round. This high-explosive round is versatile, designed to engage various targets such as lightly armored vehicles, troops in cover, buildings, and field fortifications. The M1147 round can be programmed for airburst, contact detonation, or delayed detonation, replacing older high-explosive munitions like the M1028, M908, M830, and M830A1 rounds. Another key addition is the M829A4 anti-armor round, offering increased lethality compared to its predecessor, the M829A3. This round can defeat tanks equipped with third-generation explosive reactive armor and active protection systems, such as the Russian relict armor used on tanks like the T-80BVM and T-90M. The tank's protection level remains consistent with previous versions, employing depleted uranium armor with a graphite coating. It features a laser warning receiver that alerts the crew to targeting by other tanks or laser-guided missiles, along with an electronic device to counter remotely controlled IEDs. Although not directly tied to the SEP V4 upgrade program, the U.S. Army has worked on integrating the Israeli Trophy Active Protection System onto its M1A2 Abrams tanks. In 2018, the U.S. military ordered 400 trophy systems from Israel, and additional systems were ordered in 2022. These systems were installed on the U.S. Army's M1A2 SEP V2 and SEP V3 tanks, as well as the U.S. Marine Corps' M1A1 tanks. The tank's gunners and commander sites have been upgraded with third-generation forward-looking infrared, FLIR, sensors, improved laser rangefinders, and a laser pointer on the commander site. A new meteorological sensor enhances firing accuracy in various weather conditions. Communication systems have been upgraded to include data sharing capabilities. Operated by a crew of four, including a commander, gunner, loader, and driver, the tank retains its Honeywell AGT 1500 gas turbine engine producing 1500 horsepower. This gas turbine engine offers solid performance in a more compact design than diesel engines, resulting in a reduced engine compartment size, armored area, and overall tank weight. The gas turbine's operation is quiet, but it demands significant maintenance and logistical support and consumes a considerable amount of fuel. The engine primarily runs on diesel or jet fuel but can use gasoline in emergencies. The tank is equipped with an auxiliary power unit to operate systems when the main engine is off. An onboard diagnostic system and improved thermal management handle heat generated by additional electronics and power sources. 
This main battle tank can be transported via the C-17 Globemaster III Heavy Military Transport Aircraft or the C-5M Super Galaxy Strategic Airlifter.